Hello and welcome to a quick bonus first taste video. Uh, we got a request to do the Strokes EP, Future yeah, yeah. Past Present, by uh, I think Ryan Khan was his name. This is Future Past Present. I believe that there's like three songs and each one represents like the strokes in the past, the strokes in the gotcha. present, the strokes in the future. I don't know if it's in that order or whatnot. It's but... an interesting concept. Yeah. Because they definitely have moved around a lot in my opinion. Yep. Yep. Cool. Um, anyway, let's get right to it. Let's do it. Okay. Oh, this has got to be future, right? You'd think so, yeah. It sounds like the strokes with some heavy pads. Like yes. some heavy, heavy yeah. synths, basically. No, that's, that's exactly what I was trying to kind of yeah, figure yeah. out. It, it, it sounds like a bit muted, yeah, yeah. in a way. The vocals are spot on strokes. Yeah, oh, like, yeah, 100%. Yeah. I think so is the guitar. Yeah. That's what I mean, really early on in this song. I wanted to like almost make like a, it sounded goth, basically. <laughs> <laughs> it's obviously taken a departure since, yeah. but. Yeah. So this being pretty much the second chorus, I like how it's built, it's built from the first chorus. Yeah. And in that regard, the choruses function pretty well in this song. It's pretty strange. Yeah, it's alright. I mean, it's... It wasn't blowing my mind or anything. No. This is immediately, like, a bit more my taste, I think. Yeah. Song. If I had to guess, this would be present thus far. Really? Yeah. Oh. I don't know, I'm getting a bit of a past feel. You're a past? I guess it's a little bit anglesy, but um, I think the guitar makes me think it's more anglesy, and the the drums yeah. are a bit more complicated too. I yeah. feel like angles have some of the most complicated okay. drums of any of their albums. Yeah. If we're referring to past as like their their first two albums, yeah. then they're very energetic and pretty raucous, but yeah. they are still really yeah. they're, they're still really in, well engineered records. There's no lo-fi really even in the equation so it's hard you can't make that comparison so and in that regard like i'm enjoying this song for what it is it's it, it feels very like typical strokes yeah 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 oh maybe you are right this is this is pretty present yeah is that the ride yeah yes i got it you i got ride it. <laughs> that's interesting mm. his vocals it's very like whaley not like a not like a, a whale mm -hmm. animal. I mean, like he is whaling. <laughs> See, I reckon this is past. Do ya? It's tricky, but I think so. I think it's a lot more straight feeling than just like, yeah. A lot of specifically is this it was very just like. Yep. Okay. Yeah, no, I see what you mean. Yeah, no, nah, you're right. Throwback strokes. Yeah, this is, <laughs> this is big time. This is like. 2001 B-side territory. Yeah, yeah. totally. It, yeah. it could be, yeah, yeah. for all we know. <laughs> it could be. Ah, yeah. You said it. I did. <laughs> I'll take credit for that. <laughs> this song is a pretty good example of what first captured my imagination with the strokes. Yeah. In order to, for it to truly be early strokes, yeah. it just needs more like distortion in the a vocals. Descent into madness. Yeah. <laughs> it's a bit tame for yeah. early strokes. But it's enjoyable. Mm. I think I'm enjoying this one the most. I agree. I was going to say that. I think it's the simplicity that I like. Or well, the simplest version of the Strokes is my favourite version of the Strokes. Yeah. That's almost like Phoenixy. Yes! Yes, it totally is. Yeah. Cool. Alright, that's Future Past Present. Mm -hmm. I think it's called Future Past Present. Yep. Although we think the order of the tracks was Future Present Past. past yeah. It was a Strokes release. Yeah, yeah. For I sure. mean, nowadays Strokes release don't come with the same sort of fanfare that they used to once upon a time. Mm -hmm. um, they're still making fine music. Yeah, yeah. They're definitely not pushing the boundaries in any way, not even on this EP. Yeah. Not even with that future track, I, I felt. Yeah, I, th I feel like the first song, which I feel best represents what they're referring to with future, is a bit, um, definitely a bit messy. And it feels like it's for the sake of being messy too. Okay. It's just like, let's make this really weird and obscure. So I didn't really resonate with that one very much. That was pretty forgettable for yeah. me. Because I feel like the second song represented their present the most. It was like, it was nice. And like the parts that were being played were pretty intricate and interesting. And they weren't showy either. That's not, that's not the point. They weren't like, oh, no, look, look how no. cool what I'm doing is. Yeah, exactly. It was just like, I feel like they were just exercising some of their um, technicality just just because. Yeah. So I don't know. That, that one was like fine. Yeah. I, I, the second song was pretty cool. But um, I liked the last one the most. Yeah, I agree. Because of... Simplicity. I think yes. just the simplest form of the strokes, again, to reiterate, I think is my favourite. 
there's just something about his nonchalant vocals and like and literally just the four on the floor um, drum beat just like yeah it's just like really straightforward and it just works really well yeah and it is a tricky one because in any band i always encourage like experimentation and you should never just stick with one thing that's yeah. not very admirable that's the thing with the strokes i feel like they're uh, like they obviously have their place in indie rock fame yeah, yeah for sure um and it's well deserved but nowadays they're they're making Strokes music, but there are a lot of people making Strokes music yeah. and potentially even better than what the Strokes are making mm-hmm. Strokes music right now. Yeah. I think with going with a concept like they have for that EP, I think they knew that too. Yeah, Down exactly. Right. Like it's just like, well, if you like us in yeah. the past, here's a little song for you that you'll enjoy. Uh-huh. So in that in that sense, they're smart guys. They know exactly yeah. what they are. And I've, and I've heard that um, I haven't listened to Julian Cas- Casablancas and The Voids, mm-hmm. but apparently he's had some like really good, interesting stuff okay. happening there. And so yeah. I think that's where he's taking his new direction sort of stuff mm-hmm. um, and keeping the strokes as a kind of simple strokesy band. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Cool. Anyway, we need to rush off. So um, I hope you enjoyed that and we will see you again soon for the avalanches which will be up very shortly have a good one